works the ball through to William. He's running at the defender who slipped, went to ground too easily. There's a chance for William to get a shot away. He set up Victor Moses. Will he pass or shoot? He shoots the ball. This is inside pass. Very unlucky for Victor Moses. It looked as if he was trying to set up the Diego Costa with a pass to the far post, but the ball caught the goalkeeper out, as you see the replay, and he's curled, curled it just nicely, two or three more inches to uh, to the left, and that would have hit the inside of the post, and Chelsea beat one goal up in the first 13 minutes. Good effort from Victor Moses. As Wolfsburg will win a free kick just inside the Chelsea half. Stanfest. Hits it behind the players, Matic picks it up, but it's hit first time, oh, that's nearly the first goal. First time effort by Thomas Zundel, just outside the area. Poor clearance from Matic, ball falls to Zundel, hits it with the outside of his right foot, tries to bend it with the outside of his right foot around goalkeeper Asmir Begovic, but just pushed it too far around the outside of the post. Not the best uh, cross from the right-hand side, but uh, it, I did uh, Matic a disservice there, I think. It was Ivanovic who, uh, no, it was Matic, plays the ball, runs at Solbayer, finds Dega Costa very well. It's chance for Matic to snapshot, but he plays the ball unselfishly to William. Ball into us. First goal of the match for Chelsea. Some good work on the right-hand side. Good sliding uh, crossfield pass into the six-yard box from William. Two Chelsea players attack the ball, but I think it was Bertrand Traore, number 14, the... Burkino Faso International got there just ahead of his more experienced number 19, Diego Costa. Matic into William. This was a very good ball. Very well read by Traore. No. Uh, Diego Costa actually was the first to go for the ball. Couldn't quite get there. Traore followed him, followed him in. Got there ahead of defender number 26, Michael Sobayer. Cannons in off it. It's three against four at the back here. Good ball from William, just behind Diego Costa onto his right foot. Dummies back onto his left. Moses makes a run, takes the defender away. And a very good snapshot from Diego Costa. Left-footed, lower cross goalkeeper Alexander Kofler. Might have just been sneaking inside the goalkeeper's left-hand post, but a goalkeeper gets down very well and just his left hand to it, away for a corner. As you see, that may just have snuck in. We can't tell from this angle. Diego Costa certainly looks sharp today. Didn't play too badly against Rapid Vienna. First time in the game. It's going to be swung in. And Stephen will indicate what he's going to do. Six Chelsea players in the six yard box. Unmarked at the far post. That should have been the equaliser. Number seven there. Dario Beldov left in lots of space at the far post. Antonio Kittens, uh, Conte will be having kittens when he sees this. No player within 10 yards of him should have directed. He had plenty of time to pick his spot. All he had to do... Oh, oh. And number 36, Ruben lost his cheek. Very quickly sets up. Number 23 onto his right foot. I'm sorry I'm telling you it's number 23. It's just... Obviously a work in the pass. It's great pass from lost his cheek there to Moses. It slots it neatly to Matic. He's got a chance here at the near post. Very unselfishly pulls it back for Chiloba, but uh, nearly an own goal there. It's a corner for Chelsea on the left-hand side. There's some good work on the left, particularly between Moses and Matic, but a great ball out to Moses in the first place from Chiloba, uh, from Loftus-Cheek, rather, as we see Matic pulls it back. Luckily, uh, Peter Schoenig's attempted to William. Oh, great through ball. This could be the second goal for Chelsea. Neat pass. Oh, cleared off the line. Well, uh, Pietator isn't familiar with him. As you see, tries to go around the goalkeeper. Play back. Well, I think it hit the player's shoulder of all in uh, the hand, so I think it was right not to give the penalty to the team. Yes, we get the second goal of the game. That caught everyone out by surprise. Ruben Loftus-Cheek, number 36.
20-year-old England and the 21-year-old international. Steve Holland looks very pleased with Conte giving instructions. We await the replay of, of the goal. As you can see, the set-piece corner swung out. Goalkeeper perhaps should have come for that. Certainly was the goalkeeper's ball, but a uh, very brave header from Loftus-Cheek, knowing that the goalkeeper, Wolfsberger, as we pan in on the coach of Heimo Pfeifenberger, the coach of Wolfsberger, as we go three goals, the flags up, unfortunately, for Chelsea there. Good move. I think it's Chilova. Breaks, thinks he's broken the offside traps, just gone a second early. Look, again, Loftus cheek trying to set set the player up. No, it's, it is, I think, Loic Remy, right hand side to Matt Miazga, gets his first touch of the, the ball. Great run, great ball into number 36 there. Loftus cheek, his first touch, hit with the inside of his right foot, trying to catch a goalkeeper out. Did, Reacted very well, but uh, it was just blocked on the line by Augustine. It stopped the, the Blues going 3-0 up as the corners played short, this time into Chaloba. Onto his left foot, he's going to fire a shot, no, cuts into his right foot. Cuts in, and it's 3-0 to Chelsea. Good work there from Nathaniel Chaloba. Makes his way into the corner, looks to the heavens, surrounded by his fellow players, he's let on by... Ruben Loft, since he's been at Chelsea, he's been alone five times, come through the Chelsea ranks, picks the ball up on the edge of the area, cuts across with his right foot, takes it into his left foot, then back onto his right foot, completely loses the defender, Rabic, cuts to about 12 yards away, hits it perfectly across the goalkeeper, Christian Dobnik, and like all strikers like to do, has hit the inside of the netting, side netting, to put...